you guys so it's a start of a new week it's monday today um and i didn't film last week because i was quite grumpy last week <laughs> and i just have my grumpy weeks my work wasn't going quite how i wanted it to and then just it wasn't a good week so i really didn't feel like pulling out the camera that week but this week is a new week starting fresh and um i have my tutorial this week on my first toile um, which was actually moved from Thursday to Tuesday which is really so this weekend I've just been on the floor pattern cutting and making my dress today I have my business lecture at 11 and then I'm gonna go to the gym after that with Amber and then I'm going to come back and try and make some gloves <laughs> I feel like making these gloves could send me into a really bad mood again but I'm gonna try it and then for the rest of the day I'll just be working on my sketchbook and getting everything ready for the next day for when my tutorial is I had my hair in like twisted braids last night so that's why it's gone oh curly whirly yeah not much else planned for this week so we'll just see where it goes I guess I'll have to start making my second outfit as well so it's gonna be another busy old week but right now I'm gonna go and make some porridge Morning guys, it's Monday today. We have Halloween this week, which I'm really excited about. Um, and yeah, so this is what I'm wearing today. It's freezing outside, so I'm going to bring out the giant teddy bear coat. But I have on this roll neck jumper from H&M. Um, my jeans are quite old, but they were from Zara. Um, and then my boots, these are new. These are from And Other Stories. So this is what the giant teddy bear coat looks like I'm so glad I ordered this because it's so warm and also last time I looked it was like completely sold out they've probably got it in stores um, but if I leave a link and it's in stock and you want it I'd get it now I think it's gonna be a very popular coat this year so yes that is my little outfit for today so as an update on my work um, I've been quite busy <laughs> since I haven't pulled the camera out we had to create two outfits for this project and I've finished twirling the first one and I've now decided my second one and I'm going to be twirling that um, my first twirl is over there so I'm sure you guys will see it on my design Instagram account at some point yeah I had a tutorial for it last week and now this week they're expecting the second twirl as well as that um, so then we can start making and final fabrics which I'm still not sure about yet for my final fabrics which i need to kind of decide soon <laughs> so yeah that's pretty much it for that i have my business lecture today can't wait and i'm gonna go to the gym as well afterwards um or between lectures so that is that it's too cold to wear gym clothes out now i've decided the wind and cold just goes straight through gym leggings and they're just too cold i'm gonna pack my uni bag now please put my gym stuff in it like that one. Oh no, my lashes have come off already. Just got 
got back from uni and the gym and I'm gonna have a late lunch it's 3 46 um, very late lunch for me I normally have lunch at like 12 <laughs> but I had my first lecture then me and Amber went to the gym then we had our seminar and now I'm back home. and I made myself the most ginormous sandwich which I'm definitely not gonna be able to finish and I've also got a banana and berry smoothie so I'm gonna eat that and watch some friends Tuesday evening, I'm about to go into uni. I have just chucked an all black outfit on. It's really cold outside again. So I'm wearing my velvet leggings, um, this long sleeve Bershka jumper and a little thermal underneath. And then these little clips are from Accessorize. And that's my little evening outfit. Um, and then for coat, I think I'm gonna wear this long checked one it's from tesco been sewing all day and um nearly finished my second twirl which is good because i realized my crit is next week so i have to have everything finished i like to have everything finished for the crit but we'll see how things go try not to get too stressed <laughs> Wednesday morning now um, I have been very busy this morning um, well it's actually midday now but um, I got up and I just got the urge to finish my twirls so they are all finished now which just feels so good so now I'm going to go into town do some little bits and bobs that I need to do um, come back try making something that I wanted to make if I had time um, and then I need to crack on with sketchbook work. And tonight is Halloween, so we're going out to a friend's house. 
for a party there. So anyway, I will show you what I'm wearing to just pop into town. It's a very brown outfit. So I have on this old jacket from Pull and Bear, which is just, I think it's just my favorite jacket ever. Um, I kind of hope they bring it back this year so I can link it for you guys. Then underneath I have this really cute jumper on from ASOS. These dungarees um, were from Zara last year. They're like cord dungarees. Um, and then my boots are from Clarks. And that is my little outfit. Yeah, I'm going to go into town now and go and get some bits and bobs. I also just need to get out of the house today because otherwise I will go crazy. And that's my like task for every day is to at least leave the house once so that is what i'm doing it's a lot later and i thought i'd show you what i'm wearing it's a halloween party i didn't go with any of my other skimpy outfits because it's freezing outside and i just need to be warm and comfy so i chucked this look together i'm gonna say i'm like a vampire wife <laughs> if anyone asks got on my trainers as always. And then this jumpsuit is from Boohoo, I think. It's got cute little side detailing. And then I've got this fishnet underneath. And then this is the makeup I've just put on, hardly wearing any foundation. <laughs> put this together in about 10 minutes. Because it's my tutorial tomorrow and I'm stressing out big time. Not necessarily about the tutorial, but having everything made for next week because it's all in twelve form and it has to be in final form well, final fabrics next week I've also booked a photographer and the studio on Wednesday morning so I have to have stuff done by then basically so it's going to be busy busy times for me if you're wondering where my little earrings are from they're from Primark I mainly just got them for the shoot next week but I thought I'd kind of wear them today I also got the longer version which comes down to about here, which I love, but I thought they'd annoy me. Now I'm going to go and have fun with my friends. It's Friday morning and I've just been filming a little charity shop vintage haul because um, I feel like I haven't filmed enough for this week for it to be a whole vlog yet. So that's going to try and go at this weekend, although I don't know when I'm going to have time to edit it. But yeah, my fabric is all arriving between 12 and 1 so basically as soon as that arrives I'm cutting and making because my shoot is Wednesday morning and that is not much time to get two massive dresses made but it will be alright I had a shower this morning did my hair nice actually put makeup on um, I've just been so stressed this week um, I was really worried that I was gonna throw out this morning but I didn't which is great um, but yeah problem is like the real stress hasn't even set in yet like it's not even pre-collection or final collection yet <sighs> so I just gotta get used to this put a little clip in my hair just to get my hair away from my face I've got another one that I'll put in in a minute but I look a bit funny sometimes with two I just feel like it makes my forehead look really big <laughs> yeah that is the plan for today um I'm sorry I haven't really been very good at filming this week but at least once this project's finished I have my reading week so I can take a little bit of a breather although of course that is the time where all of the jobs come in and I'm like yeah I've got a week off and I don't really have a week off because I've got to do all my research for my collection <laughs> uh, and have time to see my family and have time to see Zach and have time to just have me time. Nice to have a week off, but also stressful. I also put a lot of pressure on myself in these weeks off to get so much done. I also end up feeling really bad when I come back after that week. So I'm gonna try not to do that too much this time. Oh, and I also have a business essay to be thinking about. <laughs> but right now I really fancy a jack of potatoes. So I'm gonna go and put one in the microwave and then put it in the oven for a bit so it's quicker. Um, so hungry today. My fabric has all just arrived, thank god, so I can start cutting out um, my pattern pieces in final fabric now and start making. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. But now that I'm not waiting in for this delivery anymore, I can go out and buy my bonfire night ticket, which is tomorrow evening, so I kind of need to get it now. But there's a really cool firework display that we're going to go to and um, I'll bring you guys along. 
I won't put too much firework footage in because that can always be really annoying. I thought I'd just show you my outfit before I head out. Put on my Ray-Ban sunglasses. Then this jumper is from H&M. It's so snuggly. Coat is from a charity shop. Jeans are also H&M and shoes are Nike. And bag is old ASOS. <laughs> I've just tracked some makeup on to go out this evening. We're going to the bonfire night. But I'm currently eating some cucumber. My dress is coming on quite well. It's over there in the background. There's still lots of little bits that need doing to it. Like there's a big bow going here. And um, this top bow needs stitching down. So that's how that's going. I had to order some more of this fuchsia fabric because I ran out and then this is my second dress ready to be made but this is part of my outfit for the evening I've got my glossier sweatshirt on because it's so warm these H&M jeans with thermal things underneath these boots which are from UGG they're like snow boots but they're just so warm and I hardly ever wear them so I'm gonna wear them so I'm gonna wear this black jacket from Zara that I got last year. I really wish they'd bring this back because I would actually buy another one. I love it that much or at least like in the same exact cut because it's just so flattering. And then I've got on my H&M scarf. I'm pretty sure they still do this sort of one so I'll try and link it below. So that is what my little outfit looks like for this evening featuring cucumber. <laughs> So the last clip you guys saw I was making outfit one and I have now finished both outfits and have had my crit. <laughs> it just all like came at once and I just completely forgot to do anything other than making. I've had my crit yesterday and I got back and I just fell asleep. I was so tired, I'm still really tired but I'm feeling much better today. I'm going back into uni for five today I went in to model for some other people's crits and um, yeah we get our new brief at five so straight on to the new project and yeah I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of the outfit number two because you haven't really seen that and then I'll show you the photos that we took on the photo shoot so this is how the little bag turned out in the end they really liked it in the crit which was amazing. I thought they might not have liked it for some reason. So it's second dress in here. So this is the second outfit. It's made in linen, so it's all a bit creased from being in the garment bag. But um, yeah, this is what it looks like. Super cute. And then the back has this huge bow and a little tie, which is really crumpled, which is not the best way of showing you guys. Um, but yeah, that was outfit two. And then I did a little photo shoot with Ella and Holly. This was one of my favourite shots of the outfit. My computer's making a lot of noise. <laughs> but these are just some of the initial photos. They've got like a really vintage -y, grainy look to them. This was just an experimental one. Holly looking cute. I love this one, I think it's so fun. And then some nice close-ups. Yeah, those are just a few that I printed out to show in the crypt. Right now I'm just doing a bit of replying to emails, editing a video to go up tomorrow. And then I'm gonna start on my portfolio pages for this project. I took some photos of my sketchbook from above. We have a really cool um, like bird's eye photo studio. So it's so much better than the scanning. Um, so I've got lots of images to be editing away at 
and that is the plan for before I go into uni and then this evening is Helen's 21st so I'm going to be having a party here. Okay this is my outfit for tonight. I didn't film what I wore to go into uni. I've got on this t-shirt from All Saints. It's just tucked into my skirt which is new. I picked this up in the H&M showroom the other day. It's very comfy. And then these boots are a bit insane. <laughs> but these are from La Moda. Uh, so that's what those look like. And then hair, I've just gone with really straight. And I've got a little choker thing on from, um, I think this is from New Look. That is my outfit for this evening. I think I'm gonna end this video here. I really hope you guys have enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments down below if you did. And yeah, next time I do one of these, it'll be a completely new project, so starting straight back to start again but anyway i hope you're all having a great day and i will see you in my next video bye